want to acknowledge that today's event is taking place on the treaty territory of the Mississaugas of the Credit First Nation and the traditional territory of the Haudenosaunee, the Anishinaabe, and the Huron Wendat. We are grateful to have this chance to work in the community. I want to remind you this film is eligible for the Gross People's Choice Award and the Gross People's Choice Documentary Award. You can vote for your favorite films at tiff.net slash vote. I want to thank Synetic Media for providing us with this help. Uh, you are the first audience in the world to see Andy Ho Green. Uh, do we have any fans of Formula E in the house? Well, 
Dan Deacon, who's an incredible DJ. I don't know if you know Dan Deacon, but he did the music for this film. Skip Levesey and his team, Rick Kleiss, John Kamen and Radical Films, Rick Yorn, and I'd also really like to thank uh, and have him say a couple words to Mr. Malcolm Benville, who uh, was my partner in crime. Thanks to Fisher for, for bringing us this amazing project. Thank you to Theo for actually enabling this to be made and actually spending time following these guys around the world, shooting photography of amazing brand new cars, showing us the way forward in terms of mobility and clean air. These cars are clean, they're faster drivers in nutcases. Um, <laughs> there's three of them here tonight. The champion, Jean-Eric Vern. <laughs> And Sam Byrne, the English driver. Yes, you can hear from Brazil. I find all these guys mad, bad, and dangerous to know. They're quick, they're aggressive. There's no reason why Formula E shouldn't be as aggressive as, as, as Formula One. In fact, I think it's more so. I think it's more competitive and it's clean. So enjoy the movie. And well, you'll get to meet some of the drivers afterwards and you could, you know, ask them questions and uh, throw things at them if you'd like. <laughs> We're looking forward to uh, taking questions after the movie and enjoy it, have fun, and uh, here we go, and we go green. <laughs>